All right, well, here's where the wire comes into the fence. Uh, kind of grow it up around here, but uh, it works just fine. I have a main wire coming down. Now the uh, coiled piece you see here on top, that's another uh, lightning protection. That's a gap in the coil to help dissipate the uh, uh, lightning strike if it hits the fence. There's a lot of uh, uh, miles of uh, wire out there for it to be hit. So then I have uh, two connectors here coming off that main wire. You can see the switches there. And uh, one's for the east side of my property and one's for the west. I can shut one side off or the other. Or if one side gets uh, shorted out, like a deer would jump over it and wrap the uh, electric uh, fence line around the barbed wire fence and short it out, I could isolate it and go and repair it. So that's what is going on right here. Then there's a ground that goes out uh, into the weeds here. You can't see it, but it is grounded. For the electric fence to work properly, you have to have a complete circuit. You have to have the hot wire and you have